couple of years ago, there was this reignited debate in the UK about whether we should move back to imperial units. For every unit, it depends on what you're measuring, whether it's imperial or, or metric. क्या है विक्स ये कैलिफोर्निया में रहता है कहाँ पे रहता है ये सेल्सियस में क्यों बात कर रहे हैं But if you're driving, you'll either do miles per gallon or miles per liter, but you will not do kilometer. And you go for a beer, of course, you're not going to say, can I have 568 ml of beer? You say, I'll have a pint of beer. Do you know there is this whole metric versus imperial units thing, sure, yeah. which I got yeah. reminded in the last episode. You were talking about Celsius. Here I was feeling that what is this? Is California? Where is it? Where is it? Why are you talking about Celsius? Why are you talking about Fahrenheit? Fahrenheit? No, no, no. Which no one yeah, except for them understands. No, Fahrenheit never makes sense for me because I was in India and zero is like very cold and minus is very cold. But 32 degree Fahrenheit is zero. If you have five degree Fahrenheit, six degree Fahrenheit, it's very cold. So it doesn't make logical sense to me. Minus nine, minus ten, very cold. That makes more sense. My mind is not tuned that way. Yeah. No, it took me also a while to get into using Fahrenheit, but I never got comfortable with it uh, yeah. all the years yeah. I was in Jersey. No, actually, when my friends tell me something in Fahrenheit, I tell them, "Kiar, let me convert it. How much is in Celsius to understand what's happening here?" A couple of years ago, there was this reignited debate in the UK about whether we should move back to imperial units. So UK is mostly metric, and I say mostly, and I'll come to that in a bit. Then Prime Minister, he given that he had become and he had supported the Brexit vote, and and that was it, and one of huge majority. He said, okay, now that we have left Europe, which was the reason why we largely moved to metric, we have to mm-hmm. move back to imperial. and that created mm-hmm. a debate i suspect it was more to as a just diversionary tactics in politics because there were other issues brewing so it's like okay let's start a, a completely irrelevant debate mm-hmm. and a lot of people started supporting oh yes we'll go back to imperial but that's when i started thinking about what happens in the uk and for every unit it depends on what you're measuring whether it's imperial or or metric it's not like uk is purely metric yes for most things temperature is celsius but if you're driving you'll Either do miles per gallon or miles per liter, but you will not do kilometers. I right? thought it was kilometers Except in. If you are running, it is it is kilometers. But in cars, when you are driving and on the signs, on the road signs, everything is miles. Largely, it is metric. Except for that exception, the the way it works is if you are running, you talk to each other. You said, okay, I did three kilometers. If you are cycling, you say I did ten kilometers. but when you're driving a car and you're talking about the mileage or or the distance then it is okay that's 200 miles then there's this other thing that's very interesting uh, what's metric versus imperial in 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 liquids for instance if you're buying fuel it is always liters so petrol diesel everything is liters if you are asking for beer it is absolutely it is in pint and just just to be clear a pint in uk is 568 ml so a bit more than half a liter if you're buying milk if you're buying milk it is in pints on in the sh- shop of course they will write oh this is 2.2 liter or something like that but the main thing is 1.2 pint and 4 pint but nowadays you have vegan milk every time you buy vegan milk almond milk this and that that's in liters that's not in pints it is absolutely confusing except that you just learn to live with it and until until that imperial versus metric came up i had completely forgotten for the last 15 years that for the first one year of my life it was confusing and then i've gotten so used to it i know when to talk liters and when when to talk pints and you go for a beer of course you're not going to say can i have 568 ml of beer you say i'll have a pint of beer yeah, but america yeah, everything, everything is um, yeah imperial, everything is right? miles yeah we don't yes, fairly go standardized back in india again everything is standardized uh, all like Liquids are in liters or milliliters, irrespective of whether it's beer or milk or whatever it is. So no confusion there.